and welcome back to the Coders Corner where we talk about all things technical in the Web3 and crypto space. In this segment, we are going to be talking about the Ethereum Improvement Proposal 3525 or EIP 3525 for shorts. Now, the EIP 3525 um, also known as the semi-fungible token standard is a new way for representing unique digital assets that can be used as financial instruments and not just collectibles or in-game items um, on the Ethereum blockchain. The goal of this proposal is to create a clear and standardized way of defining and managing these unique digital assets. In the world of crypto, there are two traditional ways of creating a token. There is the fungible way and there is the non-fungible way. Why fungible tokens use um, EIP-20 standard and are efficient, they do not provide a way to differentiate digital assets from one another. Non-fungible tokens, on the other hand, can distinguish digital assets from each other, but they do not have quantitative features. Now, the EIP-3525 gives you um the best part of these two tokens so it gives you the quantitative features and the qualitative features from the eip20 and seven to one standards hence it is called semi-fungible tokens resulting in a more manageable and flexible way to tokenize digital assets some of the advantages of this eip 3525s includes um, it gives you a clear way of representing and managing semi-fungible tokens it also gives you um, ways to transfer semi-fungible tokens so there you have it um, to learn more about the eip 3525 standard proposal um, i've written an article about it on my blog so you can check that out the link will be on this video Thank you so much for watching and I will see you in the next one.